Now it boils down to who makes them feel comfortable. This is what I believe. I'm sharing that with you for nothing. Just get out there and succeed. Who makes them feel like okay. they're going to uh, care about them, um, work the hardest, is the most dependable, the most professional, get the job done, make the transaction the smoothest? You know, that that's what matters to them is, is how well is this agent going to service this deal? How are they going to, you know, enter into different situations and, you know, help the situation go smooth? So you have to become a master at communicating to them that you are that agent that 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 cares about them the most. It's going to work the hardest. It's the most dependable. That's how I do it, right? And I do that by walking in and not trying to high pressure them into doing a listing. I walk I like in, that. I walk in there wanting to know everything about the property and I want to know everything about the reason why they're selling. See, this is how you differentiate yourself between all the other agents. This is something a lot of agents don't necessarily go deep on are some of these things because they're so concerned with just trying to get the listing signed. They're just, they're just concerned with trying to get the deal mm -hmm. done. They kind of lose sight of, you know, w w what's in it for the customer, you know, okay, we're there yeah. trying to, yeah. try, we're there trying to capitalize on the moment for us as an agent, but what's in it's it? It's all about me. Right. And it shouldn't right. be. Right. And that's how most agents are. See, this is how you differentiate yourself between all the other agents. You walk in there not trying to get the listing. You walk in there asking them about them. Tell me about the house. Tell me why you're selling. You know, let's talk about that for a while. And when you can get them talking about that and open up to you, then they feel this strong connection with you that they don't feel with other agents. That's where you're going to win. You know, not the listing of presentation, not the pre-listing package. It's the communication. And that's why we love seeing you and chatting to you about perspectives because that's really all you have is your own perspective and yeah. that basically determines the, the outcome of the day the outcome of your career the outcome of your life at the end of the day absolutely they're going to go with the agent who they who they connect with the, the best who they feel the most comfortable with who they feel like is going to do the best job right and right. the agent that does the best job does two things really well they're super dependable Okay, they do what they say they're going to do when they said they were going to do it, and they, 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 they know how to communicate. They know how to talk. They know how to, they know how to make their clients uh, feel calm. You know, like, like it, if, if there's a, if there's a serious situation, you know, and you can take the pressure off of your client by helping them stay calm. You may be freaking out in your mind, but you're staying calm through it. You know, it, it helps them you know, it helps them through the process a little bit more, right? And so so that's that's really, to me, what it all boils down to. So when you're communicating to your, when you're talking to your potential listing that's interviewing other agents, you know, you should go into every listing appointment as if you don't have the listing, as if, even if they, even if they're not interviewing other agents, you should still approach that appointment the same exact way. You know, you, you, you should you should treat it all the same.